I'm illustrating the Fong shading model and the Gorad shading in Blender by using a circle. Uh, first, we started by deleting the the default cube that is present on the Blender. Then I add, I go to add, I select a sphere. My sphere appears on the screen. It's rather small. Uh, now, by default, the radius of the sphere is is one unit, and we're supposed to make it three units. So, I enter into edit mode. I light all the vertices. Now my, my sphere is three units radius. Three units radius. Now we try to make the surface smooth. I go to the materials on the properties tab, the material properties, click on new, go to the surface, uh, I choose the glossy, you can either choose the glossy or the diffuse, they both make the, the surface smooth, now a surface is smooth. Uh, we change the color to a color that will be more visible. You can increase the roughness or if you'd like, according to your preference. Now, after that, I go to the object data property. object data property at the normals I highlight the smooth that will make our surface smooth now our surface has changed to be more smooth that's if to apply the Gorad shading I went to the object data property and made the surface auto I highlighted the auto smooth surface now our uh, uh, sphere is smooth to apply the form shading uh, at the normals again at the object data properties the normals auto smooth, auto smooth I highlight but the difference the major bit difference between the Gorad shading and the form shading is that the form shading is more smooth than the Gorad shading so you can increase the degree to your preference I'll make mine to be around 60 degrees and it's I guess someone can see the difference at 60 degrees that's the smoothness of the let me put 20 I don't know if you can see the difference but yeah, that's the difference between between both the Gorad and the and the and the form. Now I render the image. That's the result. Yeah. Thank you.